द्वार का आर डायरेक्टर हाउ डू यू आर यू एन एक्ट्रेस यू हैव अ फैंटास्टिक सेट वी कॉल इट द फेट मशीन व्हाट यू सी typewriter keys represent the keys of life and we human beings dance on them and then when we dance as we press down the keys of the machine the story that's written is the story of our fate it's very symbolic thank you It really isn't dead. It's still getting used in India, at least. I writer tip 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 karta hai, zindagi ki har kahani likta hai. There are these info slums, places where people type for a living on the street, not for creative purposes, not for writing poems or for writing novels, but for business purposes. It was recently announced that the last typewriter manufacturing plant was closing down. The last typewriter manufacturer on earth has shut down. The factory was in Mumbai, India. The company was 60 years old. It opened in the time of Nehru. Godridge and Boyce stopped their typewriter manufacturing about three years ago. They sold tens of thousands of typewriters every year until the typewriter was just killed off by the computer. Godridge brought me here to create sculptures from the last 100 typewriters that rolled off their assembly line. I don't know what I'm going to make yet. Godridge wanted the sculpture to be a symbol of their commitment to innovation, to represent their move into the 21st century. Lotus, it rises from the filth, from the murky water at the bottom of the pond, and, and blossoms into this pure, uncontaminated, delicate flower. A symbol of enlightenment, rebirth, perfection, something beautiful growing from the bottom of a dirty pond. There's no such thing as permanence. Things die, and the reborn is something new. I don't want to look back. The future is the only thing that you can do anything about. You can't do anything about the past. A lot of people are really scared about how the future is unfolding, and the only way to think about it is to be optimistic. We're going to do amazing things with technology. We have to. The thing that people who are afraid of change should remember is that people born after you aren't living. What's in their time? You can't stop the habit that people have of taking knowledge and trying to tweak the world around us with it. We're always going to do that. I don't know what the future holds for me. I'm doing what I love and I'm doing what I want. <laughs>